It's Friday, August 17th. Welcome to Pastor Bob Daily. Jonas on YouTube says, I am sad. I am so lazy. I have so many things to do and yet I do not do them. I just play video games so I do not have to be depressed so much. Do you have advice for me? Jonas, I think all of us have times when we feel overwhelmed. I've had them too. And when you feel overwhelmed, sometimes you don't know where to begin. Now, first of all, depression comes from a lot of things. And I am generalizing today as I begin to try to figure out what Jonas is saying. And I think what he's saying is that he has a lot of things that he realizes he should be doing and he's not getting them done. Now, sometimes when we have a huge list of things that need to be accomplished, we don't know where to start. Have you been there? Maybe you're having one of those days today. And instead of getting started, we kind of turn on the, the video games or do something else to be distracted and kind of push it away and the next day it's worse. And those things just keep adding up and adding up and pretty soon we find ourselves way out of balance, way out of focus. You know, there's a mentality that goes along with this and in the United States we call people hoarders. People who accumulate a lot of stuff and they can't seem to organize it or clean it. They just keep accumulating it. We have people who are perfectionists. And perfectionists either have a very perfect house or a chaotic house because if they can't be perfect, they don't want to do anything at all. Well, you may not be in one of those extremes today, but all of us have difficulties organizing our time. Here's the key. If you look at the big picture, it's easy to get started. You don't have to do everything today. You can just do something today. And by the way, folks, if you see a project as huge and overwhelming, you'll never get started. But if you can see a project as uh, small little pieces coming together to finish a goal, then you're probably going to be okay. So here's what you do, Jonas, and those of you that are struggling with the same thing. You simply get started. Now, you may feel like this is your spiritual life as well. You've really desired to do some reading, and it's in your heart to do it, to pray, to spend time with other Christians, maybe to find a church that you'd feel comfortable in. And it's just difficult to get started. It's overwhelming. Well, you you begin with pieces once again. And folks, today is a good day for a small piece, just a small one. Something that you can do to get started. Now, it may take you five minutes. It may take you 15 minutes. It may take you an hour. You decide what feels comfortable to you. And then tomorrow you do the next one. And the next day you do the next one. Now, you might not accomplish everything that there is to do in one day. But folks, if you work at it and if you chip away at the pieces, you'll get there. So here's my strongest advice, Jonas. Don't give up. And you don't have to stop playing video games. But don't use it to cover up being depressed. If your depression is coming from this big mound of things that you need to do, then begin the process of doing them. Write down all the things that need to be done. And then divide them into segments that you feel comfortable with. 15 minutes, 30 minutes, 60 minutes, two hours, whatever it might be. And every day, as much as you can, chip away at those things. And you know, before you know it, you'll be caught up and you'll feel so much better when you do. It's impossible to to tackle a large amount of things when you feel overwhelmed. It's very possible to simply get started. I want to encourage you today. You know, depression comes from so many things. But if your depression is coming from this, you don't have to be depressed anymore. Simply get started. God bless you. Have a great day.